look at what are the emerging testing areas where one can specialize in. So while we were doing the research, uh, we identified mobile, of course, is, uh, is, is an emerging uh, area and mobile apps testing is actually growing at a very fast rate and India is playing a, is a major role in this. So you have a lot of startups who, have, who are doing really well in mobile apps testing. So one can specialize in this area and iOS testing and Android testing are really too sought after skill sets. You can also, you can also position yourself as an agile tester. So about most of the product based companies are following agile principles and uh, there the software testing role is niche. Few processes like test driven development are being followed and there's a huge requirement for those testers who, who can work in agile projects, who can guide and you know work with the scrum team. There's also good requirement in domain specific testers. So here these testers know the domain. So they are well aware of BFSI or retail or telecom or manufacturing sector. And you know, if you know the domain, you are one amongst the very few testers present in India. There are very few testers who have acquired this domain knowledge. And you will be one of the most sought after you know, uh, testers if you if you are if you have a command on a particular domain. Then of course you have to a lesser extent, demand for testers who specialize in you know, tools. So there's, there's an increase in, open so in adoption of open source soft, uh, software testing tools. So if you have expertise in those or if you know how to use those tools, that, that also helps you in positioning your, your career. And in addition to that, we have you know, tools from Microfocus, HP, IBM, no other vendors, Microsoft, etc. And if you if you position yourself as an expert, when I say expert, it doesn't mean that you just know how to use it. You should be able to tell your organization that why usage of this tool is helping testing, and why not the other tools. So you should you have to go to the next level where you help the company determine what kind of tool they should use and and for which project, what should be the criteria. So you should start developing these kind of knowledge. And there's an, a, a new area that is emerging and that is called DevOps. And here the dev, it's a new kind of framework and there is a demand, there would be going to be a demand in about two, in about two to three years time for testers who can work in DevOps environment. So the bottom line is based on our research, based on our you know, feedback after talking to best of the thought leaders on in software testing, be a specialist. Don't call yourself or don't designate yourself just as a software tester. Gone are the days where just being a software tester will fetch your recognition. Be a specialist. Specialize yourself in one of these areas and rule the world. And believe me, software testers are going to stay. Testing as a profession, testing as a principle is definitely going to stay. As long as development is, is being done by human beings, there would be mistakes, there would be errors, and testers would be required. With this, I come to the end of, our of my presentation. I'm free to take 